Hello there guys, it's Craftsman MC here today bringing you another bucket plugin tutorial slash review. So today is a pretty simple plugin, it's not gonna take very long. I'm not gonna do a config because there really isn't much of a config, all it is is changing the messages that you get when you type in the commands. So without any further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and read the description of this plugin aloud to you. So Server Control is a plugin that helps make a staff member's job easier. The plugin was designed to let staff have an easier time trying to take care of players and the server. Okay, so the first command I'm going to show you guys is the slash control. And this gives you all of the um, commands for the entire plugin, which is basically four commands, five including the slash control command. So we're just going to go down the list. So if you saw when I joined up here, you might have seen when I clicked it, you are stealthy, bu you stealthy bugger. No one knows when you have joined. So that is the slash stealth command, which allows you to join and leave the server without being noticed, which can be very useful if you want to kind of see what, you know, what goes on on your server when people don't think you're around. Because I've actually banned a lot of admins and moderators, you know, after reading in the server log about what they would do to players, you know, and once I left the server, you know, they're being mean, stuff like that. And now you can just check in person. You don't have to dig through the server log to find evidence. So, um, first command on the list is slash work. Uh, this, basically, what the work command does is kick everybody except for you and all of the people with a certain command, with, uh, so, uh, not command, with a certain permission. So basically you and all your admins stay on the server. <coughs> Sorry. I remember times when I was just getting overwhelmed with all the players pestering me for certain stuff and I was trying to get, you know, a plugin worked out, something like that. And I just needed everybody to leave, leave me and my admins alone until we were ready to open back up again. And this can be easily achieved with this plugin by saying slash work on, and it kicks everybody except for you and your server. And it said it doesn't say like you have been kicked. It says the server is the ser the server admins and owner are working. You just need to leave them alone for a while. And if I actually go over here, you can see the message of the day it says under work mode, so they know that. You're just working on the server for a little bit. It'll be open soon. All right. So the next plugin we have here is the slash warn command. Now this command is used to warn. It, it's just basically to send a, a private message to any person on your server. So if you want to warn someone that you know they're being a little too mean, you can say like warn whoever warm, <laughs> warn whoever you know. Stop being so mean. Yeah, okay, so this is not online, but it just says, yo bro, take it easy, man, or you're gonna get kicked. So that's that's pretty self-explanatory, pretty cool. All right, now we have the stealth. So I already saw it, I already showed you that you can join and leave without anybody noticing. But if you say slash stealth, it can actually, you can make it look like you just quit, see? It, it just said, you know, my name's Epoke, and it says I just left the game even though I'm still right here. So people will think that you've left, but really you haven't. I'm not entirely sure if it still will show you on your tab screen for everybody else, like, I can, like you can see right there, but you know, maybe, maybe that'll be in the next update. I don't know. I don't know if that's even possible, but we'll see then, won't we? All right, next and final command is just to reload the config if you decided to edit it. And say slash control reload and it'll just reload the config without having to reload the entire plugin folder. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed server control. I'll have a link to the thread in the description as well as all the permissions, as always. Uh, if you have any future suggestions for plugins, just comment them or you can even send me a private message if you're feeling that fancy. Anyway guys, please rate, comment, and subscribe and I will see you next time.